Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out a lot. So hit that subscribe button. Today we're going to be making a resin crystal. So let's jump in and get started. I'm going in with two ounces of a light blue tinted resin. Today I'm using the liquid diamonds. I was just going in and very carefully filling in the crystal points on this mold. And I was trying to pour slowly so I didn't introduce a bunch of air bubbles, let that cure overnight. This is the next day. I went in with some iridescent mylar glitter and this gloss varnished, mixed the two together to kind of make a glue, painted it all over the bottom of that cured resin, let that dry overnight, and this is the next day. And this is the real star of the show, this stunning Chrome X pigment and oil slick from Solar Color Dust. This color, you guys, is absolutely amazing. I ha actually made this a while back, but this pigment has been sold out. So I didn't want to post the video until it was restocked um, because you guys definitely should get some of this stuff. It's so, so gorgeous. This is probably one of my favorite crystals that I've ever made like this just because the color of this pigment is amazing. I'm going to go in with my little makeup brush. This is just a little makeup brush from Dollar Tree, dipping it into the pigment and brushing it all all over the silicone mold and I also added some on top of that mylar glitter too um, just to kind of give it a little bit of this pigment all over the bottom of the crystal as well and that's really it I'm just gonna finish brushing this on I did mix up my resin off camera just to save time but if you're new to resin and you want to see step by step how I mix my liquid diamonds I'll link one of my quick one minute mixing tutorials down in the description box be sure to go check it out in that video I show you step by step how I mix my liquid diamonds and then after I get this all spread out, I wanted to make sure every spot in that mold was covered with this pigment. I'm going to go in and fill up the mold the rest of the way with some black tinted resin. So I did do this one in two layers. And you could use resin if you want to, to add that mylar glitter, but I like to use the gloss varnish um, just because it's easier for me Then I don't have to mix up any resin. It does take an extra day because you have to wait for that varnish to dry. But it works really well and it dries clear so I like to use that gloss varnish it's just easier for me do whatever's easiest for you now I'm filling up the mold the rest of the way with some black tinted resin I did hit this with my heat gun to pop bubbles let it cure overnight this is 24 hours later getting ready to take this out of the mold check out how stunning that pigment is so so beautiful it's one of my favorite colors might be my favorite one of all time it's just absolutely stunning they have a lot of different colors in their chrome x line available but this one is called oil slick so so beautiful and my discount code nap time will give you some extra savings on the solar color dust website let me know what you guys think of this one down in the comments i hope you liked it if you did leave me a like hit that thumbs up button don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel naptime creations and go check out a few more of my other videos that would really help me out a lot helps out my channel if you watch a few of my videos back to back and as always i'll link all the materials i used down below in the description box along with any coupon codes that i have so if you guys want to get any of these products to try you'll get a little bit of extra savings but i highly highly recommend this pigment you guys will love it it's absolutely gorgeous i hope you're all doing fantastic thanks for watching bye guys